Hey everybody, it's Nufi from Nufi Loves Luxury. It's been a minute. I know. <laughs> anyway, if you've remembered who I am, hi, welcome back. Um, I have been away. So let's talk about that and let's talk about today's little somewhat unboxing. Uh, to those that have missed me and wrote some comments, hi, thank you so much. I am back. I am actually okay. It's not a health issue for me. Um, look, it's been crazy. I've been working, it's uh, across year end, I'm implementing a new system, new staff, you know, just everything that, that needs to be done is insane. I've probably been working um, like 16 hours a day. I really haven't had time to think or film or do anything. Um, my hair's a mess. I am actually took today off because I just need a break from a computer. So I probably won't upload this today because I really don't want to turn my computer on. I'm actually using my mobile phone. I'm using the front camera, so it's probably not amazing. Although I have just bought a new phone, so that will be coming. I might unbox that. Anyway, so today um, I just wanted to talk about a Louis Vuitton bag. But I also want to just let you know that for those that have watched my channel in the past, you probably am aware that I have a extremely unwell son. Um, he's terminally ill but I hope he's got more years yet I just don't know how many um so sometimes if I do disappear it's because he's unwell or I'm just working crazy hours and uh you know this is fun and I enjoy doing it but it's certainly you know my channel didn't grow the way that I'd hoped and I will put some more effort into that as time goes on um but right now life's a little crazy <laughs> anyway um I wanted to talk about Louis Vuitton, so let's talk about Louis Vuitton. I'm actually sitting on the floor. <laughs> I've got some just old clothes on. I probably have rolls here. Whatever, right? We're, we're all women. We're, we, we know what happens. Anyway, let me talk about this. So normally I am one to not buy secondhand, well, pre-loved bags. I don't know why. I think I'm just so nervous that it's not real. I don't want to be scammed I just get so worried but when I, it's from another YouTube person that I watch and I trust and I know then I feel comfortable so with that big shout out to um, Meredith uh, another Australian channel um, you, I'm sure you all know her her fabulous collection I watch her a lot and I think yes I can absolutely trust her she had a vlog sale a few weeks back I managed to get on there and um, she sold, sold through Conrad's um, closet and isn't he lovely? He is really good. I found his channel. I was like, oh, I've been enjoying him so much. So if you haven't, um, I'd be surprised if you haven't, but if you haven't seen his channel, I think he's got a few channels. I think it's Conrad's Closet and, oh, I'll link it below. I can't even remember. Uh, anyway, no, I should know and I don't. Anyway, so when she had her vlog sale, um, I thought, right, I, I will buy something from her because her bags are new. I know, well, look, it appears she really doesn't use many of them, if ever uses them or carries them. And so I want to show you what I bought. And um, it was a really smooth transaction. It was here in Australia, so it was easy postage. Um, you know, Conrad was really professional. I don't know if his name's Conrad. I guess it is because Conrad's closet. Uh, he was really professional, really sweet. You know, he, he just talks really nicely and it was so easy to deal with him. Um, so I can't wait for her next vlog because I would definitely buy something else. So I'm not going to do the unboxing because I've already, because of my crazy schedule, um, sorry, my hair and I'm hot. Um, I've already unboxed it. So I just want to show you, but one of the things that came not in the box, because Meredith always talks about it. She had to keep all the boxes from all the things she buys. Where would she store them? And I kind of understand that I don't buy anywhere near, not even a 10th. And yet, yeah, there's too many boxes, right? And I love them. I have boxes everywhere, but at the end of the day, can't keep them all. So I didn't even care about that. So it came in its dust bag, um, which I've taken it out of to show you today. And it also came wrapped up. And I know tissue paper, right? But it thought it was so cute. It came wrapped up. I kept this on purpose so I could show you on camera. So it came wrapped up in Conrad wrapped it up in this beautiful little tissue paper, which I just want to show you. So this is not the best camera. I really should be using my good quality camera. But I just ducked out to film this, so anyway, um, let's see if that light's not great. Hopefully you are seeing that. Conrad's closet. How cute is that? You can see the little doors. Well, I, I think that's meant to be a closet. Conrad's closet, CC. And the little doors. See that? How cute. 
cute. Anyway, I just thought it was a nice little touch. And, he, and as I said, he was so professional. It came really fast. I put the money in the bank. I trusted the process because I wouldn't normally, but I did because of who they were and I watched them all the time. So it's a bag. Let me tell you why. You would have all, if anybody's watched me before and if you haven't, one of my favourite bags, if not my favourite bag ever, was by the Pool Collection because there's those bright colours that I love so much. But it's actually the, um, by the Pool Collection, it's actually the, oh, hang on a moment. The, um, oh, do I have it here? No, it's sitting up in my bedroom because I'm using it today. Um, marshmallow. <laughs> my marshmallow bag is my most loved bag. And funny, it's the bag that no matter where I go, I get comments. That and that blingy Prada. They're the bags that I wear. Oh, and the, the uh, it's only a, well, not that cheap, but um, the Apple bag, you know, that I have. Anyway, that's, I think that's behind me somewhere over there. Um, I get a lot of comments on those. So, yeah, interesting. But let me show you what I bought. Oh, it's so cute. So this is the little mini, I think, I don't know if it's called mini, um, but it's the small Papillon, Papillon. And um, it's super cute. It came with a strap, which is inside, and it came with this little coin purse, which I've got to admit, it's cute. I love the colour. Um, it's actually bigger than some of the coin purses I've got. I've got those Christmas ones that I never use, but I love to have them just to collect them. Um, but I never use them. This one actually has a lot more space. I don't understand why but it does, but I still, my car key fits in it, so that's something, but I don't think I would use this, but I'll keep it just because it goes with the bag, so coin purse with the nice gold um, hardware, sorry, again, not my good camera, uh, let me see, spin, okay, so little puppy lord, it's so cute, so, so cute, I just love her. I've used it. I've used it once. It's a great little crossbody, which I'll show you. It's got the gold hardware. Um, it's small, so obviously you can just you can just carry it like this. But this is a great crossbody because it's small and it surprisingly fits a lot. Um, so the little zip. It would be nice if it opened down here, like like the speedy up there um anyway it doesn't so that's okay it was this has been this is brand new right um and i was really happy with the purchase i know a lot of people don't like these i've never had these guitar straps this is an adjustable one although it doesn't adjust very long i've adjusted as long as it can possibly go i found this super comfortable um and because it's just all pink it does say louis vuitton but it's all pink so to me to me it's subtle I mean I like bright colors I don't care about this subtle crap but um for me this is subtle but it's uh quite pretty I've used it I've used it with this I know it has this little thing to put a coin purse and I know I have the coin purse but I just don't like that look um I'd be just as happy for that not to be there I guess you could put I don't know something off it but anyway I didn't use it like that I just used it like this um and so this fits on the bag really nicely and then inside, it's pink, and it's the suede, I suppose. I don't know. Uh, it's got just little tickets in there because, of course, Meredith is very, you know, all her bags are pristine. I think it says, made, yep, made in France. It's just adorable. And this is the By the Pool, the original By the Pool. Oh, <laughs> this was the season when this stuff came out. I don't know if it was 19, uh, 1920. I don't know if it was 2020 or 21. Anyway, something like that. They had the marshmallow in this leather and I always regret it not buying it and it was too late and I couldn't get it. And then all the ones that were on the pre-love market, again, I didn't trust them. Um, and so then I weighed it and when the next by the pool came out, it came out, which is my bag that I love so much. I bought the marshmallow, but I, it's canvas, not le uh, leather, which I still love it. I actually love it because it's quite light, but I, and it fits everything. It's probably my most used bag. It actually is a clean. I didn't know how to clean it, um, but it's amazing. But that's why I wanted this. I wanted something from this collection that I could trust, which I trust Meredith, and I do not regret it. It's just the cutest little thing ever, ever. I will try to stand up and show you um, it on. But I did want to show you, um, I seen somebody on YouTube. Now, hang on a minute. I love this bag. Everyone knows I love my Riverside so, so much. Um, but the reason I'm getting this bag is I have a little, oh, I don't know how to take it off. Let me see. Oh, yes, I do. Twist, twist. Okay. Sit there, little Riverside. So I have this, oh, I bought this years ago, I think in Singapore, Louis Vuitton. 
still one of my favorite pieces but I seen somebody on YouTube hang it on their little tiny papillon and I was like oh that's cute I'm going to try that so I'm going to try that now with you guys um I always have trouble with these twisty things but anyway okay I've got it didn't have that much trouble yeah I don't know about that I think it's too big for it I'll show you I mean it's cute but I think it's too big I don't know if you see it the way I see it. It almost needs to be um, from end to end, but then it would be too small. Let me try it. Yeah, that would... Oh, oh, yeah, that's cute. I don't know. What do you think? Is that cute or is that funny? <laughs> I don't know. It'd be good if it was a bit longer and went from there to there. But anyway, that's quite cute. I'll probably put it back on my riverside because I love it so much. What a cute, this has been really nice. I've really enjoyed this. I bought this years ago, but it looks like I bought it yesterday. It's kind of cute. So let me put the strap on because I just want to show you. I know this is an old bag and it may not be that interest to people, but I love it. I think it's so adorable and it fits so much stuff. I'll quickly run and get my other bag actually and just show you what it fits. So I'm going to leave this thing on it. All right. Let me stand back. All right, guys. So... I just put the compost there because I'm never going to use that. So this is on the longest setting, which is not that long for me. And I'm only short, well, shortish, five foot four. Um, oh my goodness. I've probably got it on the back of the front. I do. Not that I think it matters really, but um, that way. Yeah, but then I've got that bit on back of the front. <sighs> Hang on. Hang on. I didn't think that would matter, but it did matter. Okay. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. I mean, it's cute, right? It's a cute little, yeah, so I don't think I like that chain on there. I've seen others and I was like, yeah, that's cute. I think it's just better without it. Let me take it off. I think it's better without it. Yeah. Anyway, what do you think? It's cute? I think it's cute. And it's really light and it's really simple. It kind of turns in, if that makes any sense. But I also don't have anything in it. Um, let me put something in it. I'll just get, I don't know. I'll just get a couple of things out of here. I'll just get a, a Victorine purse, which I... Still don't like, but I like the look. Just a little card holder. These aren't my things because my purse is in my other room. I just want to put something in it to show you that it fits really simple and there's still heaps of room in there. I was surprised how much space, this tiny bag, and how much you can get in it. Let me take that back off for a minute. Um, let me show you that because I just, look. And again, I wish the zip was longer because the only thing I would say is a bit hard to get into it, but there's heaps of room in there. Like, there's heaps. My other bag, um, this one, the little Versace, um, had this for a few years now. I always thought this was really little, but this is even smaller, I reckon. I reckon. I don't know if it is, but... But they fit about the same. This one is, I get so surprised how much this bag fits. Um, it's just got its little, yeah. I've been thinking lately about selling some bags because I'm just not using them. And I have so many little pink bags, my pink Elma, my pink um, Capucine. I just, all these pink bags, my Luna. I'm like, stop buying little pink bags. And then I go and buy this little Papillon. But I'm so glad I did. I'm so glad I did because it's the by the pool collection. I really want it. Anyway, guys, I'll put this Versace back. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to do this quick show you. I really want to do another one that I talk about what actually fits in it and compare it to a few bags, and I'll do that soon. I'm still not completely out of the crazy space at work. Hope to be soon. So, guys, yeah, I know it's been a little while, and it might be a little while more, but I am still around, and... Uh, it's only 58 days, not counting or anything. <coughs> yep, I am. Uh, until I go to Singapore. So I will definitely do some filming, some um, videoing in the beautiful Marina Bay Sands Shopping Centre and 
We'll see if I buy anything. Uh, and then I'm off to Bali for a holiday, a much needed rest. And hopefully my son is well during that time. And then I will be back with hopefully, <laughs> you know, my excitement, Christmas Louis Vuitton. Oh my God, I can't wait. Anyway, guys, thank you so much. And thank you, Meredith. You probably won't even see this because it's just a little old noofy. But can I just say thank you and a very big shout out also to Conrad's Closet because he was just so charming and lovely and uh, polite and professional and all the things that you would want. And I just felt so trust trusting of him. So, um, yeah, go buy off him. So thank you so much. And uh, it's so super cute. And I really do like it. And I really will use it. One of the things Meredith always says is I hope somebody buys them and uses them and loves them. Well, Meredith, I do. I think it's adorable. And I've already used it once. And I just love it. So thank you. Um, if you have just found me, please like and subscribe and help me grow my tiny weeny baby, tiny weeny channel <laughs> and uh, more videos to come. You know how crazy I get the Christmas stuff that's coming. So subscribe. All right. Thanks, guys. I will see you soon. I hope you're all well. Bye.